Hey y'all, Caveman okay, coming at you here from the house. Got a um, Insta Pot, Instant Pot, whatever. But you know, attempt making, not gonna attempt. We're gonna get it done with uh, some uh, strip steaks I got at uh, a whole loin of it. So I chopped some steaks, and this is leftover uh, tip of the roast. I just cut up the cubes it to make beef stroganoff tonight. So got this simmering in the bottom here. Got to put some avocado oil in, just gonna salt and pepper this and get a little brown on it, then take it out and start putting the other stuff in there. Get right back at you. Alright, I took the meat out here and then uh got some onions in here with a little more oil and the, about an onion and a half medium onions and put a cup of mushrooms in there get that cooking I'll get some to be adding noodles a little bit later and some sauce and cream but I'll get back to that in a minute all right I get the mushrooms in and these mushrooms, uh, I can, we can these ourselves, and that's why they're, they don't look light, they're dark. So, put some garlic in there, a little more oil, then I'll be adding some, I think, chicken stock or turkey stock, or beef stock, something like that, probably beef stock to this dish. That we also can ourselves bone broth from uh, rabbits, turkeys, and chickens, and beef, so, alright, we'll get back at you in a minute. Alright, it was three cups of beef broth I put in there, I'm going to put a little squirt or two of Wash Your Sister's sauce, <clears throat> and the noodles are being cooked over here not in here because this thing's I don't know I'm assuming it gets like, just like a pressure cooker but on a larger scale cooking a whole meal instead of putting it in jars but all right I'm gonna get this set and uh, get her rolling all right I get the lid on and there's a vent seal here I guess you gotta click and it's preheating to pressure cook for 15 minutes. And about ready to throw the noodles in that hot water back here. So. Right, I just wanted to toss in this, uh, I think it's kind of a dope little strainer. It's neoprene, got little clips on it. <clears throat> and test it out here, but I cannot hold this and do that with two hands at the same time. I probably could, but I don't want to show off. And we got four minutes left on this joker. I hope the meat's tender. I don't know. To be continued. The timer went off and opened up the vent so it starts letting the pressure out. My first time using one of these jokers, so Bear with me, I'll be opening this soon, adding some uh, sour cream and stuff into her, some milk or cream. All right, got her um, sour cream in here, a um, little bit of heavy cream, salt and pepper, and I'm just going to this cooking a little bit and I'm gonna use a little Wondra it's a refined flour type of thing it's doesn't clump up like uh, flour does so I use that in my dishes to thicken them up all right turned out good I tasted the meat is so tender Alright, peace out y'all.